Right now in Washington, the Securities and Exchange Commission is considering adding more regulations to money market mutual funds. And while this issue might not be getting as much attention as, say, the price of gas, it might have an even bigger impact on the economy. Money market mutual funds help businesses across America manage their financial well-being. Some money market mutual funds also invest in government-issued or government-guaranteed obligations. Prime money market mutual funds are a secure, transparent, and low-risk way for individuals and companies to invest some of their cash for the short term. Companies also use money market mutual funds to access the cash required to finance their short-term operations. Here's how this process works. Imagine a busy weekend at a large retail chain. By Monday morning, the chain has a large cash surplus in its account. Rather than leave all this cash idle, the retailer puts this money to work by investing it in a money market mutual fund, where it historically gets better returns. At the same time, cash balances of thousands of other institutions and retail investors are doing the same thing. The money market mutual fund uses the cash from these investments to purchase high-grade short-term corporate debt, debt that companies use to do things, like pay a manufacturing supplier or build up toy store inventory for the holidays, things that sustain and create economic growth. Investors receive a fair return from the companies repaying their short-term loans. Money market mutual funds provide an affordable and flexible vehicle for companies to manage their financial needs. But despite the 40-year resilience of money market mutual funds, the SEC is considering proposals that would introduce structural changes to the market, undermining the fund's usefulness and destabilizing a fragile economy. And one thing we can't afford today is more uncertainty. These proposed changes follow the successful implementation of a robust set of SEC reforms approved in 2010, which have proved to be effective through the S&P downgrade, debt ceiling debacle, and European debt crisis. So, the SEC needs to answer three crucial questions before they destabilize a promising economic recovery by putting more regulations on money market mutual funds. Why more regulations? Why now? And why these proposals? For more information, go to www.asktheregulators.com.